Is it working? Okay, cool. Please don't mind my hair. I wasn't trying to wait for my hair to dry before I filmed this video and you know, just curls weren't cooperating with me today. So we went with a bun. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video today. As you can tell by the title of this video, we are going to be doing a Balance Athletica Kingdom Collection review. And let me tell you, Kingdom has a special place in my heart because it's the first purchase I ever made with Balance. I purchased through the pre-sale the cheetah, the king cheetah. Look at this, look at how cute, Ugh, so cute. I was so excited when I got it. I immediately put it on, ran to the gym, filmed my workout, posted it on Instagram, because that's how I live my life. So for me to be reviewing the Kingdom Collection a year later as it's coming back, now as a balanced leader is like crazy to me, crazy. We're gonna go through, I don't know, just ignore my hand movements. Before we jump into everything, let's go ahead and take care of some of the logistics. So on the screen, you'll see all of my measurements as well as the release date. This collection is releasing July 27th, which is actually Balance's two year anniversary. Like how cute, their birthday. And one last thing, so because Balance is still growing and they're trying to keep up with the demand for their products, they know that they're probably gonna sell out because people have been asking Kingdom to come back for literally so so long so they're gonna do a pre-sale three days after the initial launch and it's gonna be an unlimited pre-sale so you can order as many pieces as you want however many you want you can order everything just so everyone has a chance to get their pieces oh sizing everything that I'm wearing today is in a size small the tops the bottoms everything is a size small I would say this is a very true to size collection I would say the sizing in this collection is probably the best that balance has ever done and last thing I do have a balance commission link and those who shop through my link I literally appreciate you so much with my entire heart like it hurts my heart like, but thank you so much if you shop through my link. You help support me and my little kittens, especially during this bar prep time. Like, you guys are coming in clutch. Like, you're the real MVP. Of course, no pressure. There's a bunch of other balance leaders and affiliates that you can shop through, but I just, I, I appreciate it so much, literally from the bottom of my heart. I'm not trying to drag this on or anything, but I just, I appreciate you guys so much. I just, whew, okay. All right, so now that we covered basically all the logistics of everything, we're gonna go ahead and jump into all the pieces. So jumping into all of the tops of this collection, they come in two colors, Midnight and Cloud. We are gonna start off with our Muse tee. The Muse tee, again, comes in black and white or Midnight and Cloud. It is a very cropped material. It's super, super, super stretchy. It comes with a little cuffed sleeve. And it's so cute, like the cuffed sleeve is stitched too, so you don't have to worry about it coming unfolded or anything like that. It's 95% cotton, 5% spandex. It's this cute little minimalist look, like you throw a cute little necklace on, you can have some high-waisted pants, some high-waisted shorts, throw a jean jacket. It's just overall just a cute little comfy fit. I, again, am wearing this in a small, and I would say that it definitely true to size. I might even get a medium just to have a little bit of a baggier look, but I do like this look. And I will say I did dry this, so I think that it might have rolled up just a little bit more. I think it was a tad longer when I first got it. They're just such cute little neutral pieces to have. Like all my shirts are cropped anyway, and it's just nice to have a little go-to shirt to just throw on. So next up we have the form bra. We have seen this bra before. This was in the Journey collection. In the Journey collection, however, this bra was more of a cottony feel. This material is a luxe material. This is one of their new materials. It's more sleek. It's like, it's not shiny, but it, it just has like a sleeker feel to it. For those of you that purchased through the Waves collection, if you have the Waves collection bra, that bra is the same material as this bra. Kyle, can you move? Can you, thanks, thanks son. Okay, don't mind the kitten prints. But I just wanted to show you a quick side-by-side -side comparison of the form bra. So this is the form bra from the Journey collection and then this is the new bra form bra from the Kingdom collection. I don't know if you can tell, but you can see this is just a little more of a sleeky material and this is more of a cottony feel. And then I have the form bra next to the bra from the Waves collection because these are very similar. You can tell like they're basically the same material. And we have some cute little back detailing. You can see it says balance there, all cutely spaced. We have a little intricate, delicate straps. I love a good strappy back. Can't get enough of them. This is probably more on the lower to moderate support on the support scale if we're going between both of the bras. If you are a bustier girl, you got some more lady lady bits up on the top, unlike me, I would go ahead and go with the other bra that I'm gonna talk about right after this. It does come with removable padding. I have a little hack, a little trick, a little tip. 
that I'm gonna share with you guys. I don't know if it's a trick or a hack. I save all the padding for my different sports bras, which I know is probably like weird, but I find like the ones that I feel give me the best coverage and I just, you know, it's just, I just plop it in. I just plop it right in because I don't know what that does. It gives it an extra layer. It just helps you give you a little more coverage, but I would say you don't have a problem with coverage in this bra. The pad doesn't show through the material. Just real good. We love these vibes, these white sports bras, especially since we're going with such bold patterns on the bottom. I think that it was such a good idea for them to go more neutral on the top. Next for the bras, we have the Revive bra. Now the Revive bra is for our medium to higher support ladies out there, but I I will say, girls, if you don't need a lot of support, this is a look 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 how it's doing for me. I don't have a I don't have a lot there. But this this is just it's pushing them in and lifting them up. Honestly, I love this bra. This bra was also in a previous collection. It was in the, I believe, R2.0. And in that collection, it was again more of a cottony material. And the fit on that one was just a little big for me. I got my same size as small, but this one runs so true to size you guys there's no spacing anywhere in this bra strappy back is definitely a little thicker than the form bra of course just because this one is offering more support than the form bra does in general and it is a zip up bra so you know zip it on up Again, this is the luxe material, so this is going to be the same material as the other sports bra, which is that silky, shinier. It's not super shiny, though. I don't know how to describe it until you actually get it. All right, friends, we've reached my favorite item from this collection, and that is the Rider shorts. I love shorts so much. The way that they make my booty pop and my legs look, like, I am just... In awe. I love these shorts. So I have the Snow Leopard and the Python Prince. I do not have the King Cheetah, but the King Cheetah, oh, she looks beautiful too. We have a lot to talk about with the Rider shorts. First off, we have the High Rise Seamless Waistband again. They're squat proof and sweat wicking. I sweat a lot, friends, and I see no sweat in these shorts ever, ever. Here's a little side by side comparison of the Kingdom Collection Rider shorts with the Oasis Rider shorts. Now, now, the Kingdom Collection Rider Shorts, these ones are 88% polyester and 12% spandex. So they are definitely not the same buttery feel as the Oasis Collection. And the Oasis Collection ones, again, were 80% nylon, 20% elastane. One other difference with the new Kingdom Collection Shorts is we don't have that little back pocket here like we had in the Oasis Shorts. And here's just an on top version so you can see how close in sizing they are. I will say the Kingdom Collection definitely holds you in a lot better than the Oasis did. The Oasis was more of a relaxed fit at the top and that tended to cause a little bit more gaping in the back for me when I squatted. But with the new Kingdom Collection, when I squat, I noticed very, very minimal gaping. So with the Kingdom shorts, they are 100% squat proof. I really don't see anything. I don't even see shadowing in them, at least in the pattern that I have. There's again no front seam. We've annihilated the front seam for good and then they have the signature glute contour. Now there's a couple things that I really really want you guys to get out of this review and that is these shorts do not dig into your thighs. It is one of my pet peeves when I buy shorts and the first thing I have to do is just stretch out the leg part because they're digging into my thighs and kind of just showing more of my cellulite than I would like. You know, we're we're loving ourselves, we're getting all self-love here, but every once in a while, you know, I feel a little insecure about my cellulite, just like we all do, and I don't want my shorts to dig into my leg like that. One of my favorite things with these shorts is that they stay in place. Not once have I ever had to pull them up. They don't slide down, they stay exactly where they are, the bottoms don't roll up. Like, I love them. I love the length of the rider shorts. Next, we have the Ascend Pant. Now, again, we saw the Ascend Pant in the Journey Collection. Now, with the Kingdom Collection, we have High Rise with the Tapered Fit. We have the Seamless Waistband, Squat Proof, and it's Sweat Wicking as well. And as you see, again, we've gotten rid of that front seam. We have the signature booty contour on the back with the minimalist embossed balance triangle logo on the back. Now these leggings also are about a 7 8 fit as well as the previous leggings. Just wanted to show you guys a little side by side between the old kingdom and then the new kingdom. As you can see, that middle seam is gone. And also they did take a little bit of the waistband in. You can see this one's a little shorter than this one. And it kind of goes out a tad more than this one this one seems a little bit more cinched this little seam just is a little higher than the newer ones and as well with the bottom of these ones we took off a little bit of 
like what is that like a centimeter we took off like a centimeter at the bottom so they are a little shorter more of that 7 8 look the material I would say is very very similar this one might be just a tad softer than the old one but it's still I would say the same amount of thickness but just thought I would let you guys know of those little, little tiny differences because they're subtle, but they're there. And last little note about sizing. So like I said, I'm a small and everything, but just for your own reference, I am a six in sports bras in Lululemon and I'm a two or four in their Lululemon Align pants. Just for a little bit of reference, the twos fit me perfectly. I just like the fours just if I want a, a bit of a roomier feel. With anything Gymshark related, all of the Gymshark products, I am a small in the bottoms and a small in the top. Just for sizing reference, I know I get that question a lot, like what are you in Gymshark or what are you in Lululemon? So I thought I would just lay that out there for you guys so you know one last thing that I want to talk to you guys about is the Lux pant and the Lux rider shorts that balance is coming out with I don't have that item but I just really wanted to mention it because I'm gonna order it myself and I think that that might actually be my new favorite I'm just gonna read you some of the details about the shorts and the leggings and then I'll throw up some other pictures of some of the balance leaders wearing the Lux shorts and the Lux leggings cuz girl ooh, they're so cute so the Lux Rider shorts and the Lux pants are coming in Panther and they're high-waisted. They have a seamless waistband, squat proof again. They have an ultra silky Lux material, no front seam. But the thing that is selling me on these is that they have these super cute little velvety flock material that make up the little panther spots and it's so cute. They would recommend sizing down if you are between sizes on these ones because they did make them a little bit more forgiving because they're not as stretchy as all of the other items. So that's just something to note if you're looking to get the Lux rider shorts or the Lux pants. Maybe size down if you're in between sizes just because they're not as stretchy. But yeah. But with all of that said, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope that you guys like this little review. I try to answer a lot of your questions that, that you had, that you left in that little box on my Instagram. But I will be answering more questions as we get closer to the launch. Don't you worry, I'll be checking my DMs. So if you have any other questions, if you'd like to see any other products side by side, remember that there is a pre-sale. So if you don't get the items that you want during the initial launch, three days after, there will be a pre-sale so you can get everything you want. So literally everyone is going to get everything that they want from this. And I just love that. I love that. It takes away the stress, takes away the anxiety, like we're all gonna get what we want. Okay, so I've been rambling, but yeah, that is it for this review. If you like this review, make sure to hit the like button below and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss another video. I love making YouTube videos. As you guys know, I'm sitting for the bar. I've said that a million times. I know, I know, I'm, I just repeat myself, but after I take the exam, I'm definitely gonna jump back into my YouTube game, so make sure to hit the subscribe button below because your girl's gonna come back. We're gonna come back. I love my YouTube fam. You guys are the best, so stay tuned. That's all for me. I'm procrastinating now. Okay, I hope that you guys have a terrific day and a terrific week, and I'll see you all in the next video.